Have you ever wondered what makes Copenhagen so enchanting? Welcome to the captivating capital city of Denmark, a place teeming with magic history and Scandinavian splendor. Today we're uncovering the top 10 must-visit locations, the thrilling Tivoli Gardens, the picturesque Niehaven, the iconic Little Mermaid, the majestic Rosenborg Castle, the grand Christiansborg Palace, the regal Amalienborg Palace, the unique Round Tower, the comprehensive National Museum of Denmark, the towering Church of Our Savior, and the quaint Nieboder. Join us as we unveil the beauty, culture, and elegance of Copenhagen. Experience the magic at one of the world's oldest amusement parks, Tivoli Gardens. Nestled in the heart of Denmark's capital, Tivoli is more than just an amusement park. It's a delightful mix of traditional charm and modern thrills, a place where nostalgia and innovation intertwine in perfect harmony. Step back in time as you stroll through the historic gardens where century-old trees and blooming flowers create a tranquil oasis amidst the bustling city. Yet the park's age-old charm doesn't overshadow the exhilaration of its thrilling rides. From the adrenaline-pumping roller coasters to the gentle carousel rides, there's something for everyone. But the fun doesn't stop there. Live entertainment, from mesmerizing ballet performances to enchanting pantomime theater, ensures a lively atmosphere day and night. Whether you're a thrill seeker or a history buff, Tivoli Gardens promises an unforgettable experience. Tivoli Gardens, where history and fun blend seamlessly. Discover the postcard perfect scene at Nyhaven. This vibrant district is more than just a waterfront. It's a living, breathing painting of Copenhagen's rich history and culture. Imagine walking along the dock, a delightful array of colorful townhouses on one side, historic wooden ships bobbing gently on the other. Each building a different shade, a different story, from pastel yellows to deep reds and blues. They are like jewels set against the backdrop of the clear Danish sky. The air buzzes with the sound of laughter and chatter as locals and tourists alike enjoy the lively atmosphere of the bustling cafes. Here, the aroma of freshly brewed coffee mingles with the salty tang of the sea, creating a truly unique sensory experience. Amidst this kaleidoscope of colors and sounds, you'll find that Niehaven is more than just a destination. It's an experience, a memory waiting to be made. Niehaven, a picturesque waterfront district that is a must-visit. Behold the iconic symbol of Copenhagen, the Little Mermaid, and the stunning Rosenborg Castle. Our journey begins at the harbor where the beloved Little Mermaid sits, a graceful statue inspired by the enchanting fairy tale of Hans Christian Andersen. This emblem of Copenhagen, perched on a rock by the waterside, has been captivating the hearts of locals and tourists alike since 1913. The tale of the mermaid who gave up everything for her love of a human prince resonates in the hearts of people around the globe, and her bronze and granite incarnation is a testament to the enduring power of love and sacrifice. Now we shift our gaze from the harbor to the heart of the city, where the majestic Rosenborg Castle stands. This Renaissance castle, built in the early 17th century, is more than a historical monument. It's a treasure trove of royal artifacts. A tour through the castle is like a journey back in time, winding through the rich tapestry of Danish royal history. From the grand throne room, where the Danish crown jewels sparkle with an otherworldly glow, to the knight's hall with its fascinating collection of silver lions and coronation chairs, the castle is a showcase of opulence and elegance. But it's not just the royal treasures that capture the imagination. The beautifully preserved interior of Rosenborg Castle, with its intricate woodwork, ornate stucco ceilings and exquisite tapestries, offers a glimpse into the lives of the kings and queens who once called this castle home. Walking through the castle's rooms, you can almost hear the echoes of royal banquets, political intrigue, and courtly love affairs that once filled these halls. And let's not forget the castle's tranquil gardens, the King's Garden, the oldest and most visited park in Copenhagen. It's a peaceful oasis where you can wander amongst the manicured hedges, blooming flowers and historic statues and soak up the serene atmosphere. The Little Mermaid and Rosenborg Castle, two of Copenhagen's fairy tale charms. Immerse yourself in history at Christiansborg Palace and Amalienborg Palace. Our first stop in this scene is Christiansborg Palace, a place where the grandeur of the past meets the vibrancy of the present. As the seat of the Danish parliament, Christiansborg Palace is a living testament to Denmark's rich political history. Its grand halls echo with the voices of the past, where every decision and debate has shaped the nation's story. 
The palace's royal reception rooms are adorned with opulent furnishings and intricate tapestries, each a testament to the exquisite artistry of the period. As for the tower, it's a marvel in itself. It stands tall over the city, offering panoramic views that stretch as far as the eye can see. Next, we move to Amalienborg Palace, the official residence of the Danish royal family. Here you'll find not one but four identical Rococo palaces, creating a harmonious architectural ensemble that's a sight to behold. Each palace stands proudly around an octagonal courtyard, their facades a balance of simplicity and elegance that's characteristic of the Rococo style. The palace complex is a symbol of royal grace and dignity. Its meticulously maintained exteriors and interiors serving as the backdrop for the lives of Denmark's reigning monarchs. These two palaces aren't just buildings, they're time capsules. They hold within their walls stories of power, politics, and royal lives lived, each room a chapter in Denmark's narrative. As you walk through their halls, you can't help but feel a sense of awe at the history they've witnessed and the elegance they exude. So, take a moment to appreciate the grandeur of Christiansborg Palace and the regal charm of Amalienborg Palace. These aren't just stops on a tour, their journeys through time offering a glimpse into the heart of Denmark's history and royal heritage. Christiansborg Palace and Amalienborg Palace, where royal elegance meets history. Ascend the Round Tower and delve into Danish history at the National Museum of Denmark. First, let's navigate the winding paths of the Round Tower, an architectural marvel that graces the Copenhagen skyline. Unlike most towers, you won't find a flight of stairs here. Instead, a unique spiral ramp winds its way up the tower's interior, making for a unique ascent. As you journey upwards, the city begins to unfold below, each twist and turn revealing a new perspective of Copenhagen's charm. Once you reach the top, you're rewarded with a panoramic view of the city, a breathtaking tableau of spires, rooftops, and the sparkling waters of the harbor. Now let's shift our adventure from the heights of the Round Tower to the enlightening exhibits of the National Museum of Denmark. As the country's largest museum, it's a treasure trove of Danish history, culture, and archaeology. Every exhibit tells a story, from the earliest Stone Age tools to the gleaming sun chariot from the Bronze Age. The museum takes you on a journey through time, uncovering Denmark's past and offering insights into the country's cultural evolution. You'll find yourself immersed in tales of fierce Vikings, royal dynasties, and the rise of modern Denmark. It's an enriching experience that brings the past to life and deepens your understanding of this enchanting nation. The Round Tower and National Museum of Denmark, two must-visit destinations on your Copenhagen adventure, both offer unique experiences. One takes you to the city's literal heights, unveiling a bird's-eye view of its architectural elegance, while the other delves deep into the roots of Danish history and culture. Together, they paint a vivid picture of Copenhagen's past and present, offering a captivating blend of knowledge and beauty. The Round Tower and National Museum of Denmark, where you can view Copenhagen from a different perspective and learn about its rich history. Climb the Church of Our Savior and walk through the historic neighborhood of Nyboder. Let's start with the Church of Our Savior, locally known as Vor Frelsers Kirke. This Baroque church is a spectacle to behold with its distinctive helix spire and external winding staircase. A climb to the top is not for the faint-hearted, but the reward is worth the effort. As you ascend, the city's landscape unravels before your eyes, revealing stunning views of Copenhagen and the surrounding area. This panoramic vista is a testament to the city's architectural grandeur and urban charm. Next, let's stroll through the historic neighborhood of Nyboder. This district is a vibrant splash of color with rows upon rows of yellow houses lined up like a painter's vivid palette. But Nyboder is more than just a pretty sight. Each house, each street whispers a tale from Copenhagen's maritime past. Built in the 17th century, these houses were originally intended for naval personnel, a testament to Denmark's proud seafaring history. Today, their charm remains undiminished, offering a glimpse into a bygone era. Here in Nyboder, one can sense the spirit of the past blending seamlessly with the rhythm of the present, creating a harmonious blend that is quintessentially Copenhagen. So whether you're an ardent history buff or an architecture enthusiast, you'll find something to love in the Church of Our Savior in Nyboder. Here, history and architecture intertwine, creating an unforgettable experience. The Church of Our Savior in Nyboder, where history and architecture intertwine, 
Copenhagen, a city where every corner tells a story of Scandinavian splendor. We've journeyed through the timeless Tivoli Gardens, the vibrant Nyhaven, and met the iconic Little Mermaid. We've explored the regal Rosenborg Castle, Christiansborg Palace, and Amalienborg Palace. Ascended the unique Round Tower, delved into history at the National Museum, marveled at the Church of Our Savior, and strolled the charming Nieboder neighborhood. Thank you for joining us on this virtual tour of Copenhagen. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more travel adventures.